Alright, so what's going on today? Let's go in the shop and we'll talk a little more. Turn that light off. Alright, so what we got going on today is the company is coming in to install the fire extinguisher because by law you have to have a fire inspection fire extinguisher is going to go right there um then once we get that once we get that uh the chairs are coming today so a, a big it has to be an 18 we're like i'm delivering them <coughs> so the four chairs are coming today and i'll get all four chairs set up then, oh yeah, I need to show you guys my hog. Little hog. I don't know why the cameras, I think these LED lights are interfering with the camera, so the footage is kind of jacked up. I don't know why, I think it's the LED lights. But I'm waiting on the chairs to come in, so the chairs will be here today. Once they come in, I'll put them together. I might do a time lapse of putting them together. The fire inspection guy is coming. And I'm still waiting on my barbershop license. I applied for it two days ago. I'm still waiting for it to go through. I think I can still open my shop while it's going through because I know in Florida, for instance, if you take your barber exam, you could put up a, a thing saying that you took your barber exam, a paper, and you could still cut. So I don't know really if I could do that with the shop thing. I'm probably just gonna just cut in here and just put it like I already applied and paid for it. Not like I had to pass an exam. But, um, and they don't have to inspect it for 90 days. So I'm just gonna pretty much just, I don't know, just put up my application on the wall. That's it. And I'm probably gonna bring my stuff here this week, uh, tomorrow and start cutting here this weekend. So stay tuned, chairs should be here. Fire inspector should be coming. We'll get with it in a minute. Oh, I'm tired. Let's carry all four barber chairs in here. We got them here. One, two, three, four. I'll put up the camera here and you can watch me assemble it. Here we go. Let's go.
looks like they put that in there to hold it in place so it don't break. So take it off. Now I see what I'm using is torques. Just hold it in place like it's tight. Tight. About 
five minutes to install that. It's hot as all hell in here. Oh, that's comfortable. And nice and wide too. This guy's got to break it in a little bit. Expensive chairs go up to higher. The, the, this here, this is chintzy. This is real cheap. I'll tell you that. That is like garbage. Like my cheaper chair has a stronger bar in the back. But whatever. That they could have did better on. I'm not even gonna lie about that. And to get it back in, it's a pain in the nuts that. Put it back down. Kind of tight, I guess you have to break it in. Good. Good. Got the two things for the bottom, are they? Oh, they gave me some mountain keys. Duh.
happen you see the time lapse of the um of the chairs got all four chairs put together we got them in i'll get into the barber pub experience after this the chairs seem good quality to me i think they're more like instead of being like a thousand dollar chair i think they're more like a eight hundred dollar chair just because there's some things that are a tiny bit cheap on them i'll do a review on them but i like them i do like them i don't think they're worth a thousand dollars but Maybe I was old and things went up in price, but whatever. So, we got our chairs in. Four chairs. That station's in my house. As soon as I get that borrower license to come in, I'm bringing my station. I might even bring my station here tomorrow. I might even be here tonight, I'm not sure. Because I think you can still run a shop that you applied for, so whatever. But these are the chairs. Pretty nice. You can stow them away. You're not using them. Just to get some more room. Which I like. It's supposed to stow away. Ah, I'll figure it out. Whatever. But anyway, so. We do got the chairs here. Put this back down, put this back down. All right, we got all the chairs here now. So next step is to get my, only thing left for me to do is to get my approval from, from my barber shop license, which like I said, I've already applied for it three days ago. And I know in Florida, if you take your test or apply for your test, you can still work in a barber shop while it's pending. So I'm pretty sure same thing happens with a barber license. I've already paid. You just have to say, yes, I'm going to pass inspection. Obviously, I mean, I'm going to pass inspection. I'm not being cocky. I'm going to pass inspection. Trust me. Um, so I don't know. I'm going my stuff here tonight. I'm not sure, but that's pretty much it. Uh, we're getting there. Next thing I got to do is put up the sign outside the barber shop signs. Uh, might work on that tonight. Might put it up today. We'll see if I can reach him. And that's it, man. We're about to open soon. It's about to be opening day. So I hope you enjoyed this video. All right. Stay tuned. More to come. Out. Yeah, yeah.